What's up, Ryan Scott, and welcome back. So for today, we have yet another Mortal Kombat 11 video, and for today's video, we have Ed Boon himself basically confirming a leak. But before we get into any of that, be sure to smash that subscribe button if you haven't already. So with that being said, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so in this video, you're gonna need to keep track with a lot of things and really use your brain. And the reason why is because someone on Reddit did some real detective work between Ed Boon's tweets, the leaks, the dates of the leaks, and the tweets. And he basically found a pretty good correlation that leads to Ed Boon confirming a leak. And I'm going to explain myself in just a minute. But before I do, let's get to the comments of the day. So first up, we have Melina. Yep. Next up, we have... Also, we haven't had a female guest character in any NRS game. So Harley is a safe bet based on that alone. Now, this tweet really... I mean, this comment really made me think of uh, all the games that we've had so far. And I found that it was right. We haven't had any female guest character. In MK11, we have Robocop, Terminator, Joker, Spawn. In Injustice 2, we had a Hellboy, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. In MKX, we had all the horror characters, Jason, Predator, Leatherface. And yeah, guys, we haven't had any female guest character. So I think it's about time we get a female guest character. And Harley would be such a good choice. And lastly, we have... Hey Rams, is there any DLC characters that people want that you don't want in MK11? Yeah, there's really two, and please don't hate me guys, but it is Ash Williams and Melina. And the reasons why is just because I really don't care about them. Like Ash Williams, I never really watched his show, so I never really got into him in the Ash vs Evil Dead, never watched any of that. And Melina, dude, we've had her in almost every single MK game. I think it's time she could sit one out. The characters I would love to get would be Cyrax, Sector, Smoke, Takeda, Ermac especially, uh, Kenshi, Goro. Those are characters I would love to play as once again. But anyway guys, back to the video. So go ahead and check that out. Now this was the initial post. I'm just going to read it through first and then we'll discuss it. So this guy said, Okay, so Ed Boon said that the, that the good thing with all the fake leaks is that they drown the true ones. Which means that one of the leaks after Aftermath was the real one and it got buried under a pile of BS. Now this is an annoyed tweet made by Boone on the 15th of June. My guess, one of the leaks posted on this very subreddit between the 8th of June and 15th of June is the real deal, the real leak. We could find it. Okay guys, so this is the tweet that he's talking about. So this tweet was made on the 15th of June. Now keep in mind that 7 days before this tweet, Ed Boon said, good thing with all the fake leaks is that they, they drown the true ones. Yet in this tweet, he looks a bit annoyed, right? So what a lot of people, including myself, are speculating is that when he posted this tweet, he saw that one of the leaks posted on the subreddit of Mortal Kombat leaks was actually true. And like it kind of annoyed him because he's like, damn, I can't believe something that's actually legit got leaked. Now, you might be like, okay, so what leaks were posted between those two dates, the 8th of June and the 15th of June? These are them right here. Someone actually found all the leaks posted in between those dates. Now, it's only three, but anyways, I'm just going to read this first. So, this guy said, here's the three leaks that happened within that time span. So, late May to June 15th, and that weren't debunked. Kentaro, Motaro, Goro, Moloch, and Blaze being bosses in Towers of Time. Michael Myers screenshot leak, chunks of meat leak featuring smoke in the said expansion of the crypt. There's other leaks that aren't debunked yet, but they were posted only after the 15th. That's the only leaks that aren't debunked. I looked through everything. So you guys heard it here first. These are the three more than likely possible leaks. Like one of these is more than likely true. It's once again, Kentaro, Motaro, Goro, Moloch, and Blaze being bosses in Towers of Time, the Michael Myers screenshot leak, and the Chunks of Meat leak, which featured smoke. Now, my best guess is that the one that's going to be real is the one with smoke, the Chunks of Meat leak. That one, I'm pretty sure would be the more, the more likely one. Now, I don't know at the end of the day which one it is, but in my professional opinion, guys, it's the one with smoke. Now, I don't even know if one of these is true. This is all just speculation and kind of some detective work hinting at it being true. 
But like I said guys, once again, my best guess is the smoke one. Now please let me know which one you guys think is the real one. And let me know why you think it's that one in the comment section down below so we can start a discussion. But anyway guys, that's all for today. Honestly, this was a really fun video because I love all this like detective stuff where you like look at dates and all that. I enjoy all of that. But like I said, once again, please let me know all your opinions on that in the comment section down below. Other than that, be sure to stay subscribed for more videos just like this one. Thank you for watching and peace.